Testing, testing, is this thing on? So guys, right now, I guarantee you, Strider is hoping that I will turn off that fan. However, babe, it is 155 degrees outside. We gotta deal with the excess noise, it's okay. So as is customary, before I tell you what we're working on today, I like to have a little show and tell. This is the pool here that I'm working on. Let me see if I can get those points, those veneers you see in the grays and the reds. I'm getting much, much better at these guys. I'm very proud. I don't know what I'm gonna do for the butt yet. Mosquitoes are everywhere. What month is this? So I saw this thing online. It's like this wall art, except it's not a painting or drawing or like a framed piece, you know, what is typical. I would consider it like wood art, sort of. It's got some three dimensional. Look, if you've clicked on this video, you've seen the thumbnail, which means I've already finished it, even though I haven't really started on it. So that's what we're gonna work on today. Let's get started. So step one is, first I have to show you my two by four stash. Look down here, whoa. Step one is I need to chop all of these down into one inch by one inch tubes. It's gonna be a loud, long day for my neighbors. Sorry guys, it's gonna be a lot of cutting. So working with wood that this long is super annoying. So First thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna chop it down to a manageable size. Chop it, chop it! So one interesting slash annoying thing about two by fours is, that, let me try to get it on camera. Do you see the rounded edges, how it's rounded? I don't like that, especially for a project like this. I want it flat. So step one is flatten every single piece we got. Oh, hey, babe. Hi. Oh, what? <laughs> oh, that's so nice <laughs> of you. They're so bite size and there's a teeny weeny top of it. Teeny weeny top of it. Thanks, babe. Thank you. Okay, now we have our flat side. We only had to do that, I don't know, 4,000 more times. Sweet. Guys, as my stack keeps getting higher and higher and higher, a thought occurs. We're gonna have to hoist all this weight up and mount it against the wall and hope that our house just doesn't come falling from the sheer weight of it all. Cause wow, so much noise. All right, so now we have done so many cuts. This is kind of the end result. We're looking for a pretty clean, it doesn't have to be super, super clean, but we're looking for like a pretty clean 1.5 inches by 1.5 inches. And we are fairly close. Beautiful. Oh my goodness, that took so long, y'all. That took so long. My arm, my hand is just completely raw. I can't even feel it, it's just ugh. But that was a huge step. Done, done, done. All right, this next step is gonna be super easy. We're gonna take these long sticks that we just made and we're gonna cut them up into varying widths, like five inches, four inches, half inch, totally random. Actually, the more I think about this, wouldn't it be smarter to paint before I start chopping it up? I'm a genius. There we go. Ooh, this is very satisfying. I think I got it down now. I just go nice and steady and slow and turn back around. Man, that took forever. So many pieces. Woo. All right, the next step is we're gonna make little divisions here, do, 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 and then cut, 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 cut. The end result being this. Woo! All right, guys, I'm gonna get to cutting. So we've had a slight setback. We all got a cold, not COVID, surprisingly. Just a cold, but check this out. Dude, look at this. Hilariously huge pile. Oh, almost there, you guys. So close to the end. Cut number 85. <laughs> Well, here goes everything. I'm so sick. It's awesome. All right, we have this thing. I'm trying to assess which side is best. Or does it not even matter? I think it doesn't matter. I'm in the it doesn't matter camp. Also, guys, I have a growing suspicion that my wife, she stole my scissors, my garage scissors. So there's that. Just, yep. Ooh, so this is kind of a tester run here. I wanted to see what it would look like with black on the edges with uh, color on the deep. Let's see. Also, I'm going for pink. This doesn't look like pink at all. This looks like red, but it's really pretty anyway. Oh, dude, that is super cool. Imagine a million of these in different colors. Oh, yeah. All right. <laughs> Whoa, this is turning out so good, but... Oh, Friday. Good morning. It's a new day. I, I had to put my project on hold because I'm coming down with the cold. I came down with the cold. I'm on the mend now. Day five or four. But that's not why I'm shooting. The reason why I'm shooting is this. 
I've been slowly, very, very, very slowly just pecking away at this project. I've never seen my table this pretty before. It's so cool, I almost don't wanna to touch it. I just wanna just pour polyurethane all over all of it and just call this the art piece. But we can't do that, that would be weird. So the next step is, I guess I just figure out how to start assembling this bad boy. Now we're trying to do this on a budget-ish. Like I, I've kept it under 50 bucks so far, so we're trying to keep on that trend. So I've taken uh, some more of the two by fours and I've made a very simple black 1.5 inch black frame. And it looks like the spray paint is dry. Woo! Yeah. Okay, so for the base of this thing, we're just using, I think it's one, one fourth inch. Yeah, quarter inch MDMF mainly because it's cheap and it could fit in my car. Okay, so here's the thing. I made all these measurements when I was uh, really sick and on like 14 different like, cough syrup medications. So fingers crossed, hopefully we're at least in the ballpark. Okay, the moment of truth. Oh, yo, it's like a really good fit. I'm so proud of myself. All right, so this guy will go on here. Like so. Dude, that looks so good. Okay, we got some wood glue sealed. We have a bunch of screws at the back. This thing is going nowhere. So I've gotten some of this paste, this plastic wood stuff, and I am just going through and um, filling in pores. I'm gonna hit it with some sandpaper and uh, one last coat of spray paint. We are done with the frame. One final pass of spray paint, woo! <laughs> it looks so good. It looks so good. Babe, it looks so good. Okay, real talk. Mm. How heavy is it? I calculated it. This is 25 pieces, 25 two by fours. If the average two by four is around nine pounds, this is 225 pounds. Is that gonna kill any of us? If it falls, it would be bad, but you know, we can make sure it doesn't fall. Then. Okay. Also, if we sell this house, this, this is stays part of here. The house. This is yeah. part of the house. So I've left this blank because, and this is a little stud finder that I grabbed today. Weird. The stud buddy, because uh, our really nice one is gone forever. I don't know where it is. But anyway, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna attach it to the wall, and then on top of that, Finish them out. Oh, awesome! Does that make sense? I I'll cannot work, wait. Right? Yeah, me neither. I think it looks really good. Should we just lean it and not attach it to the wall? No, we're attaching it to the wall. Okay, 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 okay. What's going on here? We are going <laughs> to phase five of installing this. <laughs> so, I can't get around. Let me explain. There's... Let me cut you oh, up. Hold on, hold There's on. There's a ladder here. Okay. Watch out for the ladder. Okay. There's two paint buckets on top of two four by fours and a piece of wood, right? Okay. So that's the height that I want to be. Now, I'm trying to get this smushed all the way up against the wall. Okay. This is to make sure it doesn't pitch forward once I get rid of this lean. Wow. Uh, it weighs a thousand Do pounds. I need to be there to help? Maybe. If I start screaming, you'll know why. Okay. Well, while you do that, nice job on the leaky teacup sign. Oh, thank you. Yeah, it's curing right now. Got to cure for 24 hours. It looks so good. It does. I just, I feel like I need to be here. I'm just trying to get it to a point where it starts leaning forward and then it's not a big deal. Okay. Oh, I can just push it like that. You yeah. Know? Okay, it looks really good there. Is it all the way against the wall? No, flesh? you ready? No, it's in the way of the can. Oh, okay, you. there we go. So now it should start pitching uh, forward. Okay. But it won't because <laughs> this. It, yeah, hold on, there we go. I'm a genius. You're a genius, I'm yes. really proud of you. Look, no Google told me to do that. That was me fumbling my fingers in the garage, stressed for two hours going, what can I do? I'm so proud of you, babe. You are problem solving naturally. It doesn't come thing? easy to him. At all, at, <laughs> at all. all. I'm like, babe, can you go get me the thing? He's like, I don't see it. I don't see it. <laughs> problem solved. Babe, there's a little yellow sliver looking thing. If I right there, it, right I there. Cry. It's on top of the thing that you dismantled. Woo! That will go through that thing? I'm trying to figure that out right now, Meg, because oh, that God, would be so, so helpful. I mean, if not, I can get a ladder to go up top and find it, but how cool would it be? That just doesn't seem logical. It's not gonna <laughs> find, uh-uh. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> like, don't be talking smack about my methods. I'll you fake a nail so quick. You need well, to problem solve some more. <laughs> you just keep working on that, okay? Okay! <laughs> So these are the star drive or whatever they're called. Yeah, you're all sweating. <laughs> yeah, look at that. That went in. 
That went in, baby. I mean, it went in, right? It went all the way in. Like, it's it's definitely in the house now. Okay, I'm gonna do a tug test. Okay. When you're done. You're doing good, babe. <laughs> I really like being up here. You just made hang out. You just, you're doing really you're doing good. You're doing real good. Good job. Yeah. You know what I do to Bubba? We, we do it to each other and it, it's kind of creepy. Hey, I like how you're doing that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's awful. So creepy. Look at that arm muscle working. Look at your arm. Uh oh. We got a stud. We got a stud. Yes! Yes! Got a stud. Yes! yes. yes. And the house goes. <laughs> Look at how many muscles are being worked oh. right now. This is so yeah. good. You're so good. Yeah. Uh, I know you didn't mean for that to happen, but I'll give you a high five anyway, because that's awesome. All right, so two screws a day for the next five days. We'll be done by this by November. Okay. Is it straight? Yeah, is it straight? Look, the bubble level. And check it out, it wasn't straight. <laughs> Look at my mod. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you had to mod it? Look, I just added little bit by little bit by little, four. Look got at it perfectly you level. problem solving. It's not too late to learn. Oh, uh, it's up. All right, wiggle test. Look, one, two, three, four, five, six, there's seven, eight screws. How many screws, pounds does a screw have? 100 pounds per screw. Oh, man, that's, is that still resting on that though? But the other side's off. Oh. So that's all that matters. All right, take that out. <laughs> that's where you want to stand, huh? That's where your intuition tells you to stand. <laughs> I'm moving. Come on. Did you? Yeah. Is it even? <laughs> it better be, it's there, it's there. <laughs> Baby, it looks so good. It looks so good. Now the next step is we need to, okay, seriously, this is what I was gonna do. I was gonna add another melamine or MBF panel for uh -huh. the top and then like hot glue. So that way we can always pull off in case we wanted to remove it. That's a good idea. You should hot glue and put a little screw or something to let you know where the screws are. Yeah. So it, maybe you just hot glue this section. Yeah. And we put little markers on those particular ones to let us know. Yeah, I, cause yeah, I think I might end up doing that. Well, it looks really cool. I love it. I gotta guess you up this area. Guess you did. Guess you did. Now I gotta paint around it. I forgot to paint. I'll just paint around it. We are approaching the end. Now we've gotten so many screws. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We've just created this fake false panel. That way if we ever move or whatever, we wanna switch it out, I can just pop this guy off to unscrew it. That fit works. So I'm going to temporarily adhesive it in here, maybe with some like really strong hot glue. Maybe some wood glue? I don't know. And then I'm gonna continue building on top of it. Babe, what did you do with my wife? Who are you? Look, even Mew Mew is unsure. She's like, attack, get the stranger. Who are you, babe? I need to do laundry. I don't feel like putting my hair up and I need to go pick up our boy. You look cute, <laughs> look I think. Look how long my hair has gotten, isn't that crazy? It's super, oh. I actually really, really like it. And I like that shirt. It's naturally wavy. Yeah. Except I, you have to fix it or it goes. <laughs> why I put it up. Anyway, I gotta go. All right, babe. Oh, dude, you're almost done. Very satisfying, but I have to say, I'm over it. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, give me to finish it, babe. Just give me to finish it. And I'm like, you do you, man. I got my own stuff happening right. over here. <laughs> like, I'm almost there. You got it, man. You got it. So I did this off camera. I didn't want to show it because it would be boring, but I had to go back to Home Depot buy more wood and start the entire process over again. Oh my gosh. <laughs> like painting, <laughs> spray painting, drawing, <laughs> dyeing. This is awesome. Hopefully it looks, it looks good. It looks so good. Good. Well, it's beautiful. Thank you, Mama. It I was, cannot believe how great this came out. It turned out really cool. It was a lot of work. At the end of the day, it uh, clocks in at 250 pounds. Oh my gosh, how many pieces? Did you end up counting them? Uh, 27 two by fours. I don't know how many little blocks there are. It's a over lot. a thousand. A lot. Well, my camera just died, so I have to use his. Okay, <laughs> cool. Anyway, I already posted these on social media, and a lot of people are saying that they want you to start selling these. Oh my goodness. And also sell all the other stuff that you make, Dude. and also, start a woodworking channel. Dude, I just, I, I don't know about any of those things. <laughs> I'm just so tired. Yeah, look at and he's like wiping his eyes. How long did this project take you? A few days, could you imagine? I do days. That and all of a sudden I get four orders for this. Oh I would man. I literally moved to Alaska and you guys would never see me. <laughs> What's wrong with Alaska? People Dude. see people in Alaska. It's just far Why away. Alaska? Well, hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, this will be the only piece of its kind. <laughs> one of a kind. <laughs> one of a kind, and it lives in this house. Yeah. Even after we sell it. <laughs> it's just part of the house now. 
<laughs> All right, guys, we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.